the cat and the vulture there was a large people tree in a thick forest a vulture lived in the hollow of the tree there were many trees around and a number of birds had built their nest in these trees the vulture was old and blind the other birds brought food for him every day out of piety in return the vulture looked after all the baby birds with love and care one day a cat came there all the fledglings were frightened and started chirping frantically the vulture shouted who is it the cat was little scared vulture i am a cat she said be aware the vulture threaten run away before i kill you the cat gathered some courage and said politely vulture please listen to me i am on a pilgrimage i have already been to 63 places of pilgrimage i have heard a lot about your wisdom please allow me to see you personally i will have the satisfaction of having completed my 64th pilgrimage after meeting you the vulture was flattered by this prize he allowed the cat to spend a few days with him but remember do not kill the baby birds otherwise you will not be spared warned the vulture sternly oh vulture do you think i will ever commit such a sin i am on a pilgrimage said that cat cunningly the cat had already realized that the vulture was blind the vulture was pleased with the cat's assurance and said to her you may share my hollow with me and together we shall worship the lord so the cat started living with the vulture in his hollow every day the cat would bring a baby bird to the hollow and kill it every day a baby bird would disappear from its nest The cat sensed this and ran away from there. The birds were confused and worried. They decided to solve the mystery of the disappearance of their fledglings. The birds entered the vulture's hollow and saw that the bones and feathers of their fledglings lay scattered on the floor. They thought that the vulture had betrayed their trust and had killed their fledglings. The angry birds got together, pounced on the vulture and killed him.